Some say laughter is the best medicine. But I say that learning to laugh at yourself is an essential survival skill. Hi, I'm Mike Sears, and this is my story number six. It takes place when I was a kid living at Ruamar, the boys' home that my parents ran. Sometimes I didn't like my foster brothers. And on this particular day, well, it was one of those times. We're out in the backyard playing chasings. The problem was, I wasn't a very fast runner. I just couldn't seem to catch anyone. <laughs> my foster brothers didn't feel sorry for me at all. They just thought it was a great joke. Hey, Mike, you're so slow, you couldn't even catch a cold, called Yui, and they all laughed at me. That made me mad, so I ran harder, but couldn't catch anyone. He must be built upside down, called Keith. <laughs> his nose runs, but his legs are all stuffed up, and again, they all laughed at me. That made me cranky, so I ran even harder, but I couldn't catch anyone. Ha! His legs are like sausages. Hey, sausage legs, called Wayne. Come and get me. That made me really angry, so I ran even harder. But I just, I just couldn't catch anyone. I still couldn't catch anybody. And then they all started to chant. Hey, sausage legs, sausage legs. Come and get us, sausage legs. In fact, I was so frustrated and cranky and angry and mad that I ran straight out of the backyard, through the back door, through the kitchen, up the hall and into my bedroom. Well, when I ran into my bedroom, I found Peter and Dad and Mum. They must have been talking about something, but I soon brought that to a halt. I said, I hate them. I hate every last one of them. They're awful. They, they keep teasing me and making fun of me because, because I can't run for peanuts. When you get upset when people make fun of you, they win, said Dad. What did they say to you, said Mum. Well, they said I ran so slow I couldn't catch a cold. And, and they, they said that I was built upside down because my nose ran and my legs were stuffed. And, and they, they said, <laughs> they said that I had sausages for legs. My brother laughed. Ha! <laughs> they told me that I had lolly legs the other day. And I said, sweet, I love lollies. Maybe you should do what Peter does, said Mum. And make a joke of it. Laugh along with them rather than get cranky. Yes, said Dad. If you can learn to laugh at yourself, they can't laugh at you. They can only laugh along with you. And if you can't laugh at yourself, said Peter, that's okay. I'm happy to laugh at you anytime. Ha! I sneered at my brother. <sighs> my dad put his hand on my shoulder and he said, if you get angry, they win. But if you get the joke, you're happy and everyone wins. But, but why are they better than me? Why can't I be a fast runner? Well, you have things that they will never have, said Mum. From the day you were born, you've had a mum and a dad and a brother that has loved you. Some of those boys have never had that. That's why we're here, to give them the love that they missed out on. So I pulled myself together. I decided to man up. I decided to lighten up and, and be more like my big brother and, and learn to laugh at myself. And as I walked out to, uh, to the backyard, my brother called out, If you can't laugh at yourself, you're probably missing out on the biggest joke of the century. <laughs> I tried to smile. 
So when I went out into the backyard, Stephen yelled out, Hey, look! Sausage Legs has returned! That's right, I said. And who doesn't like sausages? In fact, they'll roll with anything you have to say, because they're sausage rolls. And while Stephen was trying to work that out, I went, Tag, you're in. Well, I can never say that I was ever a fast runner. But the funny thing is, is that later on in my life, when my kids were grown up and I was in my 50s, I started to enter running races. I still couldn't run fast, but I could run long. And so I ended up going into quite a number of marathons in all sorts of great places, like London, New York, the Outback, the Gold Coast, Sydney, Melbourne, Hobart, Canberra, even China. And as I ran slowly across those finish lines, do you know what I was thinking? Not bad for an old bloke with sausages for legs. Learn to laugh at yourself. Then people can only laugh along with you, not at you. But if you can't, then just think of this. You may be missing out on the greatest joke of the century.